Hello, Sweet Tooth here. I hope your day is going well. I'm gonna play some more Undertale, so I'm gonna matata to you too. Let's finish this up, shall we? Oh, well, one of the runs. I sure do. No, you don't. It's a long ways back. You know, when you have headphones on, the elevator sound effect is very, very annoying. It really is. <clears throat> Oh, by the way, I went back and I got a whole bunch of health for uh, this part. There's like a save point. There's like three save points right next to one another. This is the barrier. This is what keeps us all trapped in the ground. If I chance you, please do what you must. Continue. I see. This is it then. <clears throat> Ready? Strange light fills the room. Twilight is shining through the barrier. It seems your journey is finally over. You're filled with determination! Human, it was nice to meet you. <clears throat> Goodbye. Tell that score that he's killed you once before. He nods sadly. But there was nothing to say. Damn. Gotta pay attention to the colors. Thank <laughs> you. 
That was blue, stay still. Okay, I got it. Got me on the last one. I don't really want to fight. This is why I don't like Undertale because it's so damn big. God damn it. I mean, seriously, what do you do?
don't know, I guess I gotta fight him or something. Arrgh! Take that, punk. He's so totally dead now. Oh wait, I can talk to him at least once, can't I? There we go. Doing better. Can't keep up with that.
I remember the day after my son died, the entire underground was devoid of hope. The future had once again been taken from us by the humans. In a fit of anger, I declared war. I said that I would destroy any human that came here. I would use their souls to become godlike and free us from this terrible prison. Then I would destroy humanity and let monsters rule the surface in peace. Soon the people's hope returned. My wife, however, became disgusted with my actions. She left this place, never to be seen again. Truthfully, I do not want power. I do not want to hurt anyone. I just wanted everyone to have hope. But I cannot take this any longer. I just want to see my wife. I just want to see my child. Please, young one. This war has gone on long enough. You have the power. Take my soul and leave this cursed place. Messy! After everything I have done to hurt you, you would rather stay down here and suffer than live happily on the surface? Human, I promise you, for as long as you remain here, my wife and I will take care of you as best we can. We can sit in the living room, telling stories, eating butterscotch pie. We could be like, like a family. You idiot. You haven't learned a thing. Screw you, you little flower piece of crap. In this world, it's kill or be killed. Um. Hmm. All right. Yeah. Triple said, "Open it back up." They all disappeared without a race. So. Flowey, level 9999. My world. What? Uh. Flowey, you piece of crap, what are you doing? Oh, shit. Finally erased.
Howdy! It's me, Flowey. Flowey the Flower. I owe you a huge thanks. You really did a number on that old fool. Without you, I never could have gone past him. But now, with your help, he's dead. And I've got the human souls. Boy, I've been empty for so long. Feels great to have a soul inside me again. Hmm, I can feel them wiggling. Oh, uh, you're feeling left out, aren't you? Well, that's just perfect. After I only have six souls, I still need one more. Before I become a god. And then with my newfound powers. Monsters. Humans. Everywhere. I'll show them all the real meaning of this world. Oh, and forget about escaping into your old save file. It's gone forever. But don't worry. Your old friend Flowey has worked out a replacement for you. I'll save all of your own death. So you can watch me tear you to bloody pieces. Over and over and over. What? You really think you can stop me? <laughs> you really are an idiot. What the hell? Are you sure, Sans? And you're never waking up. What the fuck? Did you really think I was going to be satisfied? Killing you only one time? Huh. What the hell? Uh, hmm. Pathetic, now you're really going to die. Okay, I mean, just... Alright, fine.
Let's just let's just give this a moment. Like, yeah, what the hell is going on here? Oh, respond in state first. Thank goodness. Bobby, fuck you, you son of a bitch. You even realize what will happen if you defeat me? I'll get a Final Fantasy victory theme. Da 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 da. That's not a Final Fantasy victory theme. What am I doing? Dodge this shit. <laughs> Call for help. Survive the attack? Don't you get it? There's no such thing as happy endings. This is all that's left. No, it isn't. Flatly up your ass.
I called for help. Okay, I, I almost got this heart. so much better. Oh my god! Oh my god! No! Purpose? Sicko. <laughs> Fuck you, Flowey. Fuck you. Okay, I got to the purple heart. There we go. Call for help. Did they just say suck? to the green heart now? Call for help. There we go! There we go! Stop, 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 please. There we go. Oh, screw you. Oh, screw you, Flowey. for help.
The hearts are mine! Punk. Die! Die! This can't be happening. You, you. You idiot. Did you really think you could defeat me? I am the god of this world. And you? You're hopeless. Hopeless and alone. Golly, that's right. You're worthless friends. Can't save you now. Call for help, I dare you. Cry into the darkness. Mommy, Daddy, somebody help. See what good it does you. You called for help. Nobody can. Boy, what a shame. Nobody else is gonna get to see you die. What? How do you... Well, I'll just... Where are my powers? Souls? What are they doing here? Mercy! What are you doing? 
you really think I've learned anything from this? No. Mercy! Spared we won't change anything. Killing me is the only way to end this. Mercy! If you let me live, I'll come back. Mercy! I'll kill you. Mercy! I'll kill everyone! <laughs> Mercy! I'll kill everyone you love! Mercy! And some more mercy. <laughs> some more mercy. Why? Why are you being so nice to me? Mercy. Can't understand. <laughs> can't understand. What the hell are you doing? I just can't understand. Flavi ran away. Oh yeah. Is anyone there? Well, I'll just leave a message. So it's been a while. The Queen returned and attempted to resume ruling the underground. She instated a new policy. All the humans who fall here would be treated not as enemies, but as friends. But people really didn't like that policy. Because of you, not only was the King gone, but the human souls had gone missing as well along with the lives of countless citizens. Nobody wanted to see that ever happen again. So the people started a rebellion to overthrow the queen. Undyne spearheaded the revolution, of course. She was pretty mad after what happened to Asgore. She threw the king out of the castle with her strength. Then she became the empress of the underground and banished the queen back to the ruins. Seems like Undyne's, hmm, even more vehement about destroying humanity than Asgore. But hey, it's not all that bad. She's not so lonely anymore. Me and Papyrus go and visit her. We bring her books from the library or play games. We even convince her to leave sometimes. As long as me and Papyrus stay behind to watch for humans, but Papyrus loves doing that. Yeah, I love staying there for a queen. I've been practicing for when a human comes along. I'm gonna be a great mom. By the way, who are you talking to? Oh, nobody. Oh cool, tell them I say hi. Fire says hi. Well, I hope things are better where you are. Later. Oh god, not you. Really? Huh. Alright, what do you want? Since you defeated me, I've been thinking. Is killing things really necessary? I... I honestly don't know anymore. I have a request for you. Prove to me, prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Get here from the beginning. Without killing a single thing. And I won't kill the king.
then you'll have your so-called happy ending. So what will it be? Will you prove yourself? Or will I get to watch you suffer? Either way, I'm interested. Remember, don't kill anyone. I can't believe this is a real thing I have to remind you. <laughs> Good luck. <laughs> Some other time though. I want to thank you for watching. Feel free to leave a comment and I hope you have yourself a good day and this is Sweet Tooth signing off. I love you.